What is going on everybody? This is Saint Denial and you're watching episode 10 of the Pokemon Brown Nuzlocke. So at the end of the last episode, I've actually walked a little bit since the end of the last episode, but only from... Oh shit, I don't want that Paris, go away. Here. <laughs> to here. Um, so, we're going to have a look at Tower Team. Uh, just a quick recap, we've got Natalia, the Venonite at level 21, Fero, the Bookcatcher at level 27, and our War Turtle, Saviour, at level 28. Uh, that route there, that I've just skipped over, if you remember, we actually caught the Venonite there in the last episode, which is why we cannot go there and get another encounter. So, let us carry on to the next city. Don't know how far that's going to be. This might be another one of those route episodes where I spend the whole day on a route. But we will see. Uh, I definitely not got 50 kinds of Pokemon. Sorry about that. No chance. I probably got like 10. If that. So let's go. And see. Okay. Okay, this is the next town. That was the shortest route ever. Perfect. So, let's go and see what these guys have got to say. Pokemon trainers pass by here often on their way to the Region League. Beautiful. I know trainers from around the world. Congratulations. You must be very proud of yourself. Uh, so, we've got Pokemon Center, but I'm all healed up. So, let's go to the Mart and just make sure we're all itemed up. Maybe? Okay. So, we will sell. Anything we don't need. No, oh, you know what? I kind of want everything. What we'll do instead is buy some potions over here. Can I afford that many? No, I can afford nine, so that's good. That's, that's perfect. Now, what else we got? Thunder beer keg. I don't know what that does, but it's too many 200 coins, and I want one, so we're going to sell something. Oh no, I'm going to sell two of them actually. Thank you very much. So let's buy the beer keg. And here it is. And let's go see what it does. Item. Oh, you can use it. Oh, I don't want to because I don't know what it does. Okay, we're going to ignore that. We'll call that that. Good things happen if you raise Pokemon diligently, even the weak ones. No way. So, speaking of weak Pokemon that you're supposed to raise diligently, that I'm not going to. I've got this Venon out here that is uh, level 21, and it's weak as fuck. So I'm going to ignore it. I'm just going to pretend it's not there. I only really want to put a lot of effort into three Pokemon, so that they level up enough without having to grind too much to take everybody on um so i'm just i'm just gonna ignore him i'm gonna find another pokemon to level up instead and what's in this ass here i want to miss something so if i i remember that the region league is north of this town because that's what they said uh somewhere oh it's a bite voucher here you go you better make room for this okay so i don't have enough room for a bite voucher see what we've got Swords Dance. I don't want to throw Swords Dance away because it's it could be really good for setting up, but I just don't have anyone that can learn it. So we'll give Savior Dig because that's actually a really good move. Which move should be forgotten? I think Water Gun. Nice one. So that's good. Uh, okay, so... Oh wait, I've just done that so that I could get the bike. You, you just... Now, if I remember, you can't actually hotkey the bike in this, and I've got the run option. It was added into this ROM, so I might not even use the bike, except for cycling road or cycling path or whatever it's called. Look, I can do this, I can run, so why even bother? And I've got speed up button, so pointless. Right, so what I'm going to do then is I'm going to get rid of the items, and then we're going to go and uh, inspect that gym over there. Let's get rid of things I don't need. So, escape rope. Don't want you at the minute. What else we got here? Repel six. 
I'll keep you just in case. Moonstone, I have nothing I can use a moonstone for. Thanks anyway. Pal, HMO1. Cut, I've got my cut slave, so don't need that. Uh, TMO5 is the triple kick. Don't need that. TM3 is the sword stance. Don't need that in a minute. Coin case can go away as well. Oh, I've got some great balls. That's good. Didn't even realise. It'd be good for when I go and get an encounter. Beer keg. Do I need that? HMO2 I don't need. Because why not? Okay, I'll leave it at that then. I've got space in case we see anything on our travels. So let's go and see the gym leader. And... Okay. Yo, champion making! Spark uses electric Pokemon, so you need to make sure and pick the right kinds against him. Grass and ground Pokemon are good choices against him. I mean, ground, I get, why? Because mm, electric is not very effective against grass, that's why. Grass isn't particularly strong against it, but I suppose that is a good reason, good enough reason to use it. <sighs> right. So let us go travelling because I want to level up a bit before I go and get that gym so let's take on these trainers over here oh and this is a new route so I can get an encounter as well so that's good oh fluffy okay wait yeah I'm weak against that but I'm, I think I'm going to swift it and just swift it to death that's okay it's an electric type and yeah critical hit does nicely thank you We'll catch you again, 236 experience. Thank you for you to lass. You're mean! Yeah, well, you're a bitch. What are you looking at? Not you, you ugly. Oh, and it's a Meowth! Okay. How do I not kill this? Maybe Fury Attack and just pray that it only hits, like, once. Oh, or just miss. Hits me with Payday, so that's pretty cool. A bit of money. Coins scattered everywhere. Let's hit the Fury attack again. Okay, here we go. Oh no! What the hell? That is so OP! Man, I could have absolutely. Oh, I could have had a Persian. Oh well. We tried. Oh, I can't believe that, man. That would have been so good. Okay. Back to business, no point dwelling on what's already happened. I've got my bird up front and these bug Pokemon are going to go down. Nah. Who's there? Paras? No. And we'll just keep smashing. I'm guessing this bug catcher is going to have some more bugs that he's caught, that he wants to battle with. Goes to 28. That's good to see. Spinarak, another Gen 2 Pokemon. It's been involved in this. I like that. And there's the peck, and thanks for coming, Spinarak. Have a nice day. How's the kids? Hope they're well. Good. Okay, so we just keep moving. Let's see where we end up. Take a look at my cool Pokemon. Happily, I'm quite happy to take a look for you, mate. So we have a Rattata, and it's taking on me, which is a bug catcher. Bug catcher's going to use Swift. Rattata's going to go down in one. Easy. And next we have Raticate. Oh, Raticate knows Hyperfang at this level, I'm sure. So that's a bit scary, but a couple of shots, he'll be down. He's not going to do much damage. Yeah, and the critical comes in clutch. And we can continue on our merry, merry way. This guy. This guy! Another bug catcher. Well, at least that's another easy win. Oh, Beedrill. Beedrill looks so sick in this. Looks like an alien with those eyes, man. Okay, so let's go for the pet, really. And it's there. Easy again. Good. Butterfree. Pretty 
pretty cool. Bet the next one's another fully evolved bug. That's what we're going for here. Being Ariados or something like that. Thank you very much. Let's use... Oh, spinner. I was close. Hit the spinner rack. Get down some. Nicely done. And next we have Ariados. And there we go. Might as well just keep going. No, I see no reason to swap. Good stuff. And there we go. Thank you very much. Thanks for the battle, dude. Uh, yep, yeah, take on this chick as well. Why are you looking at me so weird? I didn't look at you like anything. I was I was looking at the tree. You looked at me, you weird little hoe. Don't at me. So, go for the peck. Oh, you, you, you're too easy, man. Oh, that horn attack, though. Ooh, I, thought, I thought that hit multiple times, though, like Fury attack, and I was thinking that was probably going to be pretty powerful, but it doesn't. Nidorino, no, I will not change Pokemon because I am absolutely flying at the minute. And I'm going to use Fly because I'm flying. Oh, no way. Survives on one HP, probably. And then, um, to finish him off in that case. Well, that's alright. At least the poison thing didn't poison us. Bit of better luck with poison than usual. Next, this guy here as well. Yeah, we're going to do it. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, let's see how this goes. I'll tell you how it's going to go, mate. Not well for you. So, out comes a Butterfree. Not scared of you, because I've seen a couple of you already. And I've took you down in one shot. And I'm going to do the exact same thing now. There it is. Down goes Butterfree. Next. Oh, book catcher level 30. That's good. That's good. So we'll swap out and get Squirtle up from that and get him some uh, experience as well. Squirtle, War Turtle, Saviour, the Lord Saviour War Turtle. We'll get him up from. There it is. Too quick for me. Yeah, I've had that said about me multiple times, mate. So let's swap out for Saviour and... Okay, so there's a guy down there. That looks like a dead end down there, though, so... We'll go get the battle anyway. Why did you come here? To battle little shits like you, mate. Goes in with the fear. Oh, oh man, I've got ice moves. This is easy. Get the ice beam off. Oh, goes for the fury attack, though. No, oh, even with a crit, that does nothing. Nah, sorry, man. You ain't got it. You ain't got shit. You ain't got shit. Critical again, though. Is that right? No, it's hit five times though. Do you know what? He's took half my health bar down. That was impressive. And I mean, it could. I mean, it could finish me here if it went for another lot of that shit. Fury attack, but doesn't. Down he goes. And water goes to level twenty-nine. That's good. Okay, so let's get some healing on both these guys. And oh, spear out. No thanks, mate. I'm not interested. Meowth! Whoa. I believe I got absolutely mugged off by that meowth. Bodied it. And it was like, oh man, it was only a peck as well. Should have lived that meowth. Come on. It wasn't even a critical. Right, so. Oh, there's a lady down here. Let's battle her. Watch out! Okay. Last wants to fight. Wigglytuff. Ugh! Man, I hate Wigglytuff. That's freaky as flip. God, that's freaky. Oh, and it's bulky as well. Wow. Goes for the same. God, I hate stupid, stupid fairy Pokemon that just want to stall. They want to go to sleep. Then they minimise. Then they either defend. 
high in the defence, and then they just hit you with something stupid like tackle or quick attack or double a slap, and it doesn't double a slap, double a slap, and it does no damage, but just keeps going for it anyway. Why have I gone for bite again? Oh, that's just me getting angry. Keeps going for the defence curl. Right, okay. Octazooka. Not very effective. Is anything very effective against this thing? Ice Beam. There we go. Goes for the Sable. Fails. Hit the Ice Beam again. Job done. You're scary. And that was the only thing she had as well. Yeah, that's it. What you got to say? What you got to say? Botan City is not that far away. Oh, so we're closing in on another city. That's quite good. That's good to know. Pidgey, I'm not interested in you. Sorry. Oh, there's a guy there. Oh, man. I didn't want the random encounter, did I? And? That stupid guard won't let me get to the next city. What is his problem? Okay. So I guess I'm not going to the next city yet, then. She's got to say. A little beer makes the guard go to sleep. Good to know. Beer keg. I didn't put it away, which means... I can just give it to him. Whoa, boy, I smell hard beer. Give it to me. I need it so bad. Wow. I, I, I've just enabled an alcoholic. I'm an enabler. Glug, glug. Gulp. This stuff hits you. Zzz. Looks like I can get past this guy now. And complete my quest. I mean, I don't really want to, because I've still got a gym to complete. What do you want? Get lost. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't really want to be here yet. Well, you know what, actually? Let's make the most of it. Let's see what we can do. I need to go back and get that gym badge before I go any further than this, but it's still good to have a look around, right? He's not stopping me going down here either. Oh, let's, let's look for encounters. To be demolished. Coming soon. Magnet train expansion. Oh. Expressway to Kanto, Johto, and... Where, sorry? Not... Naljo. Very nice. Okay. So, let's... So, this is a cave. But what... It's not an extension... If it's not an extension of a cave I've already been in, I can get an encounter. Just as both on City, it doesn't say... Right, well, I'm... This is a, this is an encounter. This is a both on City encounter. And it's a NATO. Something else that's weak against electric. <sighs> and it's dark type, so my dark type bite won't... Oh, wait. Oh, I thought it was dark. Part dark. Is it part psychic, maybe? Oh, okay. Well, anyway, let's throw a great ball at it. And you can be another addition to the team, my friend. Everybody welcome Natu to the team. Let's have a look at the Pokedex entry. Because its wings aren't yet fully grown, it has to hop to get around. It's always staring at something. Okay. Uh, yes, we will give you a nickname, and you are going to be called... M me me maying maying meng ming ming there you go what's your name ming cool uh, I'm not gonna go any further in here because I'm gonna get any oh I'm gonna get an encounter with something amazing and I'm gonna be so upset that I didn't get it no, it's just another day too that's cool well I mean it's not really added anything to the team because it's another thing that's weak against electric, which is a bit annoying. I'd like to have a fish down here. Okay, so can I get down to the next route is the question. Yes, I can. Can I get an encounter at the next route? Let's find out. Because if I can, hopefully that might be help. something decent. Right, so this is route 58. I'm going to have to battle her. Okay, I'm not doing that. Because she's going to be over-leveled at the minute. Because I shouldn't be here yet. And that's not a risk I'm willing to take. So, 
Uh, I don't have a fishing rod, so I can't fish. Let's go to the mart. And... Hi there. I would like to buy things. We can get hyper potions already. That's pretty sick. Uh, no point yet. I don't really have enough. Something I'm never going to need there is... Revives! Because I can't do it. Self-imposed rules and that, you know? Well, this city is empty. There's nothing here. There's a house up there, actually. Okay, let's see what these guys have got to say. That's odd. Mr. Rummico is gone. Okay. Hi. Hey. Hey. Psyduck. Okay, so Mr. Rummico. Pokemon Monthly. Okay. Get out of the way. Okay, so I can't do anything yet at the minute around here. But I've got my Nato, so that's pretty cool. Um, right, so what do I do now? I go back to... Yeah, if I dig, I can go back to... Um... No, can't can't dig. I thought I could just dig my way back to... Oh, maybe I'm just going to dig in certain places or something. Oh, but I can dig in there. Alright. Well, that was just the quickest way to get back to the Pokemon Center anyway. Although it's not the Pokemon Center I wanted to go to. But I guess I never used this one. But there we are. So, see you up. And get our main, which knows teleport. And that's useful because that will teleport me back to the last gym from anywhere. Very useful. Nightshade. Okay, so that looks like it, that's going to be a good Pokemon, I think. It's going to be useful. We get him up front and switch train him. Get Natalia down away because I don't want to. I've only got her on the team because why not? So I'm either going to do one of two things now. Do I go to the gym and take on the trainers just to gauge how hard the gym's going to be? Or do I go and have a look in that building that I've just completely skipped on that route? Where that woman was stood. What is that building? Can I have a look on my time map? We'll soon find out. Warehouse. Yeah, okay, let's go to the warehouse and see what's going off there. Get leveled up so that we're in good shape for the gym. And um, we'll take on the gym next episode. That makes more sense to me. Wow, I've got all through there without a single encounter. So, welcome to the warehouse. We've got fun and games. And let's sprint through here. So, some stairs. Oh, steps. Okay. Let's have a look around. Ooh, we've got encounters down here. And it's a Grimer. That's not bad. Man, yeah, I'd like a muck on my team eventually. That'd be cool. Let's do this. Come on. Yeah, Grimer definitely takes over Nato as my number three. Surely. Surely that's better. Get the Nightshade again. Yeah. Goes for Disable. Disables my Nightshade. Do not care because I'm going to throw a Great Ball at you. And you're going to be my bitch. Oh, no way! You're disabled. Okay, let's get the great ball out there. Come on, get in. Get in the ball. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Yeah! Pokedex entry. It appears in filthy areas. Thrives by sucking up polluted sludge that is pumped out of factories. Okay. Uh, yes, Grimer has to have a nickname. And we are going to call him... Uh, Grimace. Because he's grim, but he's an ace. Grim. Or something. So, uh, what am I looking? I mean, he's not an item. Right. Okay, so I, I, I know what I was going to do now. Heal him up. 
and then put him to the front of the party. Uh, and then sack off Meng, because I don't really care about him. And then I can start training you up pretty much instantly. Against the Ghastly, for example. Ah, uh, Ghastly that I don't think I can hit. Man, Ghastly would have been nice. Okay, yeah. So, oh, and I can't escape because it's too fast. Come on, get me out of here. Okay. Okay, this wasn't a good idea. Oh, imagine it bodies me there. Bugcatcher in because he's definitely faster than a Ghastly. Yeah, maybe this isn't the best time to be training up when this Ghastly's in here. What do we have? It's Spinarak. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, not very effective, a pound. Oh, Constrict is not good. Whew. I felt like that was like going to hold me in place. Okay. This is silly. I need to get Grimace off the front before I make a stupid misclick and kill him off. Run away. Put Saviour out front. Get him trained up. And then use some potions on Grimace. There we go. Okay, so I've got TM19. Hope that's something good. So it's seismic toss. Uh, save is the only one that can learn that. It's fighting type, and I'm gonna pass for now. Might come in useful later. Who knows? The other thing I'm gonna do is use a fucking repel so I can get out of this area because it's winding me up. And, oh, hang on. PP up, that's pretty good. Oh, so this is just, there's no way through here. It's just kind of a little basement, I guess. Thanks for coming, Spinarak. But I'm going to Ice Beam the fuck out of you. And there he goes. Yeah. Okay. Let's... Oh, man, I, the music didn't even start back up. Not fighting yet. Oh, my God. It's a ghastly. Let's just get back out of this area, because there was no encounters on the floor above. That... It's a joke. It's a joke. Why is there so many spinner acts everywhere, man? Go away. Okay, we're through. That's good. Let's go up north. Ooh. Team Rocket is here. And they've got kinky whips. And they've got kinky meows. The saviour does not agree with kinkiness. The saviour is going to use bite. And he's going to sort me out. out. Goes for the Growl, which is going to lower the attack. But Bite is a dark type move. Dark is special. And the attack's not going to be affected. There we go. Cool. So now we go for Diglett. Will I change Pokemon? No, because I can absolutely one-shot Diglett with Octazooka. Goes for Growl to lower the attack again. Octazooka's a special attack, so it's not affected by that. So I can just body you. There it is. That's it. That's good. About to use Persian. Yes, let's get me old Grimace out of there. If nothing else, just to soak up some experience, hopefully. So we'll go for the pound first. He goes for the growl, she's going to lower my attack. Normal type, so the pound's super effective because it's fighting. Yes. 
Gonna keep going for the growl. Nah, looking to grind me out is what he's trying to do. Is he gonna go for an offensive move? Yeah, goes for the bite. I'm gonna go for the sable, and hopefully that's gonna do the bite. Because then, payday. It's another offensive move that he can't use though. I'm gonna eat that bite up. Oh, that's close. Okay. Now, you know what? I'm going to super potion and I'm going to keep going. Because I want him to get some experience. I feel like it could be useful against an electric gym. Because he's not weak to electric. Don't know if he's going to be able to learn. Don't know what moves he's going to learn. Like something really useful like a poison type move. Or something like that. So Let's just keep going for it. So Grimace goes for Growl again. No longer disabled. Goes for the Screech. But it misses. I hit the pound. One more of them, and we are home dry, my son. Goes for the screech, lowers the defence, I think. Defence greatly falls. Pound, thank you very much. That's the Persian gone. Next we have Dugtrio. Stick in, see how we do. No growl, lowers the attack even further. I know pound, which is going to be... Nah, that's not doing shit, man. Let's get Savi back out there. Get that Octazooka going. Ground type drug trail. Going down to Octazooka. In one move, I guarantee it! Octazooka. Growl hits again, lowers the attack. Don't care. Octazooka special. Down in one. Goodbye, drug trio. Goodbye, drug trio! And I get up to level 30. Grimace doesn't level up, which is a bit of a shame. But we'll get him back out there because. I don't think he's going to take too much damage from this Diglett, even if it hits. And at least I'll be able to get some experience. Goes for Pound, misses, and we will get uh, Bug Catcher in there because Dig isn't going to hit it. Yep. And we'll hit the peck. Thanks for coming. Yes. There we go. I goofed. You done goofed. Shout out to Mob. You done goofed. Kids, why are you in here? Not a kid, mate. 26. Oh my god, I just gave real life information away. 26. Okay, so let's go for the bite. Does decent. Hit it again. Bye bye. Thank you very much. Nice, easy, quick battle. Now we have a coffee. Yes. So let's have Grimace out there. Just to have a go. See what he can do. Smog shouldn't be very effective because I'm a poison type, I think. It's hard enough, though. <laughs> wow. That's definitely not very effective. So. Uh, we set that off straight away. And here comes our Lord Saviour to wrap it up. Poison's not going to do much. Oh, but it does poison. Smog poisons us. Thinking that's a poison type, it's not going to do much damage, but that's a little bit, uh, a little bit annoying. Ice beam's pretty powerful. Hit by the poison. Another ice beam, and we're going to be okay, I think. Yeah, perfect. And we get Grimace up to level 22. I'm stoked for... I don't know what my next evolution is going to be. Because um, I'm not one of those people that knows the level that everything evolves. But I'm stoked for whenever it happens. I mean, I know I'm going to get... Savior will evolve at 36. Grimace, I don't know. Natalia, I don't know. Meng, I don't know. So they are all guessworks. Okay, we've got a scientist. Ha! You thought I would help. No, not really. Oh, he's got his dick out. Ugh. Put that away, gross scientist. Why have you got your little penis out? Okay, he's got a Volt Orb. That's a little bit scary when I'm fighting with a uh, water turtle. And it's been known to go for self-destruct, these Volt Orbs. 
Especially when it's at that kind of health that it's at now. So that was a bit scary again. Yeah, he's gone down. Science is about to use Mankey. Uh, no, we'll not change Pokemon. We stick with a Mankey. We'll go for the Ice Beam again. Do it again. Yeah, can't do anything to me at the minute. And we have Kadabra. Will I change Pokemon? Yes. Let's get Grimace out of there just for a move. Not for long, though, because I don't want him to get destroyed. Just enough to get some experience, which from a level 25 Kadabra should be getting some decent experience. It knows. If it only knows teleport, I might just actually just chuck him back out there, because why not, right? Hits the Blight. Oh, it's a critical, and it's super effective. Goes for Disable, but it fails. Bite again. Thanks for coming, Kadabra. Good night. Oh, good stuff. Nice battle. You're good. Yeah, I am. Thanks. Next. Okay, so we can't go that way. In fact, let's just have a quick look at health. Let's chuck some poisons in there. Poisons? No, don't poison them. Potions. And there we go. Oh, we can run down here. And, okay, so there's some stairs there. This guy, darn, it needs a card key. Okay. No, I can't open the doors, you've just seen me try. Ah, someone's got his dick out as well. What's with these nudist scientists? Grimer. Uh, definitely more powerful than my Grimer. It's the bite. Goes to the sable. Misses. A lot of missing disable going on here. I'm feeling a bit lucky. Misses again. Gets the bite. Thank you very much. Well, that was nice and easy. And we get saved up to 31. Trying to learn Waterfall. I think I'll move to eight room for Waterfall. Maybe not, but let's see what we've got. Ask me what to could dig and bite. I feel like Octazooka is more powerful than Waterfall. We'll stick with that. It's about to use Weezing. Uh, yes, I'm going to get Grimace out there. Again, just in the interest of leveling him up. Uh, not ready to battle because you'll get destroyed by that thing. Bookatcher comes out. Hit by the Sludge. It's going to eat that, surely. Ooh, you know, quite powerful. But. Weezing's going to go down to a Swift, surely. Oh, man. That Weezing's pretty tanky. Okay, okay. I see what you're getting out here, Weezing. Ooh, oh, and it poisons. Oh, this guy. Okay, should have stuck with Savior for him. Ah, oh, man. Well, I didn't realise it was going to be so strong against Fero. Like, you know, Fero's been pretty tanky so far. But, oh, man, he poisons again. What are the chances? Don't actually tell me what the chances are. I'm not actually interested. It was it was a hypothetical. It was a rhetorical. Poison hits. Goes for the sludge again. But I am going to finish it off before it gets a chance to hit me again. So, that's good. Some experience points. Come on, Grimace. Level up. Ah! Coughing. Oh man, I don't know what to do. Hopefully, if I finish it off in one turn. No. Oh dear, hurt by the poison. Goes for the smog, thank goodness for that. Because these things, I think, can self destruct as well. So I really need to not take that kind of risk. There we go. That's beautiful. About to use Weezing. Yes, please. And we'll have Grimace out there. Now, Grimace, yeah, you can sit out there for one move while I heal up a uh, saviour. Yeah, he survived that. Oh, he only hits him with a tackle. So then, let's get saviour back out. 
Still poisoned. I'm not going to heal that right now because I don't want to put him out there for two turns in case he gets smashed. But I think even with poison, I'm going to be able to finish this guy. I'll go for the dig. Hurt by the poison. That's fine. He goes for an attack. Does nothing. I hit the dig. Hopefully that's going to body him. Oh, and he survives it. Yeah, but I think an ice beam now is going to be the end of that. It's, maybe it's a little bit risky, but... And we have... Perfect. Drat, how could I lose? Apparently, very simple. You just weren't very good. Actually, you know what? You did give me a decent run for my money there. I had to do some swapping about. I had to do some healing. Props to you, my friends. Let's just get ourselves nicely healed up. And we'll go up them stairs and see what's cracking up there. I have no idea how long we've been going for. I can't see the timer, so let's just let's just keep at it. I'm not really bothered. I'm going to get to the end of this thing. I guarantee that. Right, oh, okay, so I'm going to have to battle him. No getting by that. Feeling lucky, punk. I feel like that's a reference to something, but I'm so uneducated. I just don't know what it is. My chop. Fighting type. Ooh, level 29. Wow. Things just got a little bit more intense. Those are my chops. have karate chop, which generally aren't that powerful, but they've got a high critical hit ratio like that. Uh, even with the critical, it didn't do too much damage. And there it is. Uh, for some reason, I missed the Octazooka there, which is strange. Hit bite. Oh, that doesn't do enough. Low kick. Oh, that could be dangerous. It's not. Bite finishes him off, thank goodness. Because that was, again, rather scary. But we're looking good. Machoke. Yes, we will. Let's get ourselves a bit of Grimace out there. He will get absolutely destroyed if he tries to fight this Machoke. So, we'll catch him. Now, is flying weak to fighting or is fighting weak to flying? One way, I'm sure one way or the other, that's how it works. Uh, before, so while we work it out, let's just do a bit of a fly. Okay, so fighting's weak to flying. Easy. Look at you. Oh, that's good experience. Come on, Grimace. Level 23, good. Doesn't learn any move, though. That's a bit annoying. Flame on. Okay. Can't afford this. Okay, these aren't rocket members. You are, though. Uh, yeah, well, let's take you on, then. Oh, not this again. Oh, no, not this again. I can't believe it. I don't really know. Like, not this again. I guess I've battled him before, but they all look the same, so... How am I supposed to know? Hit the bite. Yeah, man, I'm not on... You see... I definitely think they want you to have done the gym by the time you get here, because I'm not high enough level to be uh, taking on these things. And I'm only really leveling up one Pokemon, uh, two Pokemon at a time, so... About to use Zubat while we change Pokemon. Yes! We'll get Grimace out there again. Soak up some experience. Come on, Grim! There it is. Pound. Okay, so wing attack. That's not going to be that effective. Oh, you know what? Hit quite hard. Why are you not, not affected by Pound? What typing are you? Goes for Confuse Ray. I hate being confused. Honestly, Confusion is the most annoying status effect in this game. It's so annoying. Come on, Bugcatcher, get out of there. Beat this punk! This is a bite. Not bothered. Don't care. Not going to touch us. Hit the Swift. Knock him out. Yes! Beautiful. Not even a critical, and that's not the iron one. Well done, Bugcatcher. Let's use Golbat. Don't think I'm going to have the same kind of look with a Golbat, really. So let's go for the fly. Oh, man. What's with Golbat's eyes? That's disgusting. Oh, wow. My my fly missed. I thought fly was... I mean, I don't know. I thought fly was a good accuracy move. But... Oh, well. It's well. Do you know what? We're going to go for another fly because that is seems to be the way to go here. 
Very good. And down he goes. Bukashi gets level 31, and we defeat Rocket. What do you mean, you traitor? I think it's time for me to retire. I've never been a... I've never been a member of Team Rocket. How am I a traitor? Team Rocket leader is upstairs. Defeat him. Okay, so I'm going to get to battle Giovanni. If... I mean... I don't know when this is set in the timeline, but... I'm pretty sure Giovanni's going to still be the leader of Team Rocket. Maybe? Uh, there's another door down there. So let's take this guy on and we'll get Grimace back out front so that he gets levels from whatever this first guy is. Come on then dude, another guy with his dick out and it's a coffee. Which again I feel like is not going to be very affected by my pound for some reason. Really need a new type in, a uh, new type move on that thing. Now uh, you know what, pound is fighting type in this that's why and it's like poison type or something and that's the that's the that's the resistance I don't know something like that so peck's not very effective but I went for it twice anyway because I'm not paying attention smog is super effective and it poisons so we go for the swift down he goes should have gone for the swift straight away Ah, swift straight away. He's about to use coughing. Now we're sticking. And we get the swift. Look by the poison. Uses the tackle, but I can swift him and finish him off before I get hurt by the poison again. And then, yeah, we can swap out. Uh, yes, I will swap, even though it's technically weak. I'm going to go in with Saviour. It's not whole health, so it could be risky, but... Do you know what? It's a good way to test whether or not I can beat these electric Pokemon with Dig. Because I need to know whether that's going to be any good for me when I get to the gym. Yeah, down in one. Brilliant. Saviour goes to 32. Scientist is about to use Drowsy. Uh, I will not change. I'm sticking with Saviour. And we'll go for the dig again, I think. Goes for the sable, it fails, hits the dig. Oh man, that's a powerful move, dig. Confusion. Yeah, not too not doing too much. I hit the bite, which is super effective. Down it goes. And last but not least, we have Hypno! Now, Drowsy didn't give me much trouble, so I'm gonna stick in. Man, that hypno is ugly. There's the bite. It's super effective. Goes for the headbutt. It's not very effective. Go for the bite. Super effective again. Come on, one more of them. One more of them. Hypnosis! You so annoying, Hypno. How annoying are you? I didn't mean to press fight. I was supposed to swap out. Goes for confusion. It's okay. Oh ha! scary oh man puts me to sleep again how do I beat this thing okay so we can eat a few moves from that I'm sure so let's just use the opportunity to do a little bit of healing yeah you know what I changed my mind oh man I, oh god no I need to oh but I don't want to sack you off Okay, risks. Risks are being taken here. Ladles and jelly spoons. Goes for the headbutt. Survives with five. Save his back out there and he's awake. And we're going to hit him with a bite. And that is going to be the end of Hypno. Goes for confusion. Don't give a fuck. Oh, we do give a fuck when he crits. Don't our speed. Oh, thank goodness for that. That's a scary battle. Oh, wow. I uh, can't get through there yet because I've not got a card key. Oh man, I've got a poisoned Mon. I've also got a sleeping Mon, which is a bit scary as well. So we'll wake in you. 
It's a little bit wild, this is. Oh, I'm not sure I'm doing the right thing right now. Should I just go back to the town, heal up, take on the gym? So I'm going to have to fight Giovanni in a minute. That's going to be a tough fight. Okay, let's take on the next guy. Well, I mean, if there is another guy before Giovanni. If not, I guess we're taking on Giovanni. And we'll take it from there. Okay. There's the director. There's Giovanni. There's a random gap with no item in it, even though there should be, because it's pissing me off that there's not. And I've got to take on this, this rocket member. That's okay. Let's see what he's got. Here he is. He's got three Pokemon. First one's an Onyx. Uh... I've got Grimace up from... Damn. If I had Savior, that would have been over so quick. But I'm probably going to have to take a hit. Might be for Screech, though. Rock throw. Doesn't do much. I can finish it with Octazooka in one go. Yes. Simple. Experience for everyone. Do I have to use Haunter? Ah. Uh... No, we stick him with that as well. Goes for the hypnosis, doesn't affect. Go for the bite. That's super effective, but still doesn't do a lot. Lick isn't going to do much of anything, but it might paralyze. It doesn't. Hit the bite again. And one more of them, and we're looking good. Nightshade again shouldn't do too much. It's going to hit, but not too hard. Oh, you know what? That's scary. Danny goes. It's about to use Kingler. Now, Kingler has Guillotine. Guillotine is a one hit KO move, and it's not likely to hit. Its accuracy is low, but if it does, it could be game over. Okay, so we go for Fly. We're out of speed, so we can see what he's going to try. Tries Bubble first, so. Okay, now he's... The guillotine! Oh, thank goodness! Flipping it. I fly again. Leah fails. Hit it. No, he doesn't. And it goes for the bubble, which is going to hit. But we're eating that up. And we fly again. We just keep flying. Getting out of its way. Hits the fly. There it is. I only hit it one more time. And I outspeed it. So a pet finishes him off. No guillotine. He goes first. How does he outspeed me? He goes first. I hit the peck. Oh, wow. That scares me. Okay, I've stopped. You can stop crying. Now, here's the question. Oh, it's, Boku it's a PC. Oh, that's good. Who knows? Maybe I need items. I don't, but could have been useful. Oh, wait, there's an escape rope there. No, better idea. Teleport. Man, I'm so good. Can't use teleport. Okay, I have got dig, though. So we dig out of here. Back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, get healed up. Wow, this episode's been going for a long time, man. But I'm not leaving it here. We're going to do the Giovanni battle. I'm going to run straight back there now. And I will see you in a couple of minutes. Okay, so we're back. And here's Giovanni. And uh, let's, do, let's see what he's got to say. What? Another kid trying to stop me from Team Rocket's goals. I think that you need to be taught a lesson about behaving, kid. Bring it on, bitch. Oh, I'm so nervous for this. This isn't a good idea. Why am I here? Why am I doing this? So he's got a goal bat, level 29. We're going with Grimace. He starts it with a Confuse Ray. I hate Confuse Ray. And we live through it. We go for the power. It does absolutely fuck all, but we're not bothered because I'm only soaking up some experience. Now's where I'm thinking about what I'm going to do next. So we get Bugcatcher out of there. It goes for Bite. That's going to hit pretty hard, but I can survive that. We're going to go for Swift. 
Beautiful. Buy it again. He gets a crit this time. Now get swift again. That could finish it off. And it does. And it gets a crit. Useful. Grimace Ghost level 24. I'm about to use Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn's a ground type. So we're going to go for Fly. That Stomp though, that could be nasty. Uses Guard Spec. Oh, you dirty bastard. That is Dotty. We'll hit the Swift. Yeah, you know, you know what? Stomp's going to hit hard. You know what? It's time to give up on you and get Saviour out there. <sighs> Horn Attack. Doesn't do any much of anything. We've got Octazooka though. That's going to finish him off. And it does. Nicely done. Bugcatcher grows up a level as well. About to use Marowak. Okay, so I feel like I can afford to put Grimace out to get the experience again and then bring in um, my old friend Water Turtle. Goes for the guard spec again. That's fine. Now, you know what? I'm going to hit you a few times. See what you do to me. Bone Club. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Damn it! <sighs> the risks you take, man. The risks you take. <sighs> That's not going to be helpful when I go to that next gym. That might be, though. And he's got a poison, poison, which makes complete sense. I am not going to switch out. I'm going to stick with the saviour. Hit the ice beam. Finish it off in a couple of goes, probably. Although with my attack, though, well, ice is special again, I think. Might not make any difference. No, it not do very good. Growl, lowest the attack again. That's cool, because I'm going to go for Octazooka, which is definitely a special attack. I don't care. And it poisons. Good. He only goes for Growl. That's a bit disappointing. I'm glad because it means I can smash him to bits, but he's a little bit disappointing. And there's the Octazooka. Thank you very much. Good night. Farewell. God bless. Thanks for playing. I lost again. Sorry about that, mate. You stopped us from taking over the Sylph Warehouse. I guess I should just give up. There's no way we can succeed with kids like you. Goodbye forever. Mm, I feel like I'm probably going to see you again. Somehow. Is everyone okay? Yes, thanks to you. You're a brave kid. It was nothing really. I need to repay you somehow. Oh here, have this expensive gift. It means a lot to me. Shiny stone. Make sure to visit our main building located in Saffron City, Kanto, when you have the time. Shiny stone. Don't know what that does. You're my hero. Well, give me something for it then. Man, what's the point of being a hero if no one's going to reward you, you know? And somehow I still don't have the card key. Thanks for everything. It's alright. Give me a card key, someone. I want to... Thanks again. You're welcome. Thanks again, kid. You're welcome. You're a true hero. You're welcome. Again. Still don't have a card key. Anyone? Anyone want to give me a card key? There is... Absolutely no card key in existence. I'm not going back down there. Oh, hey, up. Hi. Oh, it's you. Thanks again for saving us. Here's a card key. Okay. So, that's a bit annoying. And let's go and see what's going off. All right, so now Team Rocket's gone from there. Oh, hang on. There's a scientist here. You beat Team Rocket all alone? That's amazing. Reward me, man. So now that 
that Team Rocket member's gone from there. We can go in here. I don't really know where this is, though. I mean, it's the equivalent of Pokemon Tower, right? I would never go in the forest. So it's some sort of forest is what it is. Missing those are loose. Okay. And Pokemon is lost in the woods. No one knows why this place is haunted. I heard this place is haunted. Yeah, because that woman just said it. Okay, well... That's something to worry about at a later time. So, here's the deal. I'm going to use myself a little bit of fucking dig teleport. I'm going to use teleport. Walk past Pokemon Center. Yes, please. And here we are. Heal up. And I'm going to go and take on the uh, gym. Not really anything else left to do for the Team Rocket thing. So, hopefully, the levels we've got at the minute are going to be enough. I am a little bit scared. I'm not going to lie. But... I can deposit myself this um, knobhead that I've just killed. Deposit Grimace. Sorry, Grimace, but meh. And now, go take on this gym. So, I'll do that next episode. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, leave a like, subscribe if you've enjoyed it, and I will see you next time for episode 11, where we're going to get our third gym badge. Good.